Tell who we are. Okay, we are the Cheap Shots. Okay, that's right, because we're behind masks, so you can't <laughs> tell. Yes, yes. We just got back from our first train robbery, and so we're here now <laughs> to do our first COVID concert. We're working really hard on giving expression with our eyes. They'll do that. No, not to me. <laughs> very good. Very good. All right. So. I'm not first, a very good winker, but. Well, okay, Erica had a great idea, too. For, for this intro, we're all going to say the same thing, right? Get yeah. ready? One, two, three. Hello, Hello Hope Bears. Bears. We are so missing you and dancing and everything. But we're here to have a good time, so let's do Chattanooga. Ready? Ready! Relatively speaking. <laughs> Recognize us. We are the cheap shots. Uh, 
This is Bill Velasi, my sweetie pie. I mean, they're all sweet. John <laughs> Renduzzi on piano. Erica Garrity right hey, over here with her, her new addition. Oh. <laughs> Dave Perra, she calls him her fiance. Is that cute? She calls him all of too. Well, <laughs> this is a family show, Bill. Okay, and Peter! Esrick! <laughs> <laughs> who, who arrived here with six, count them, six cameras to do this. I figure after this event, uh, he's going to like do a garage sale or Craigslist <laughs> with all of his equipment. But anyway. Hey, and one more. Pat Rufo uh -oh. um, on fiddle and voice. So Peter, tell us what's this next tune. Okay, this next tune is uh, Du Bois Highway. Uh, it's uh, I thought it was Dubois Highway for a long time, but I looked it up today, and uh, Seth Houston, who wrote it, uh, did it uh, in Du Bois, Wyoming after a backpacking trip in the Wind River area. Oh. Uh, Seth is with Lift Ticket, and they played at the Folk Madness uh, dance camp uh, about five years ago or so, and stayed in my house. And uh, I stole this off their CD, and if we're lucky, we'll remember some of it. <laughs> Sounds good. <laughs>
going to introduce this song because he was born in Sleepy Hollow, New York. Right. We were the headless horsemen of Sleepy Hollow, <laughs> which struck fear into all the people. <laughs> anyway, save money on helmets. Oh, yes. <laughs> It's called Ichabod's Last Ride. We got it from our wonderful festival we go to in September, except not this year, uh, in Winfield, Kansas. And they got it, the car camp there got it from a Canadian group called Flapjack. Anyway, here is Ichabod's Last Ride. Well, this is a song uh, from pretty local to central Missouri, actually to Cooper County, uh, Boonville, where I've lived for uh, a long time, 40 plus years. And um, uh, this is our, it, it's a song from uh, written by a friend of ours, a great mentor and friend and colleague, our friend Bob Dyer, uh, the late historian and poet. And it's a, it's a song he wrote about a local legend of a real person, uh, a slave named uh, Guinea Sam. He was known as Guinea Sam because he was a conjurer. And there are legends about Guinea Sam, and so Bob put them into this song. And I will play this on a recent acquisition for me. This is a gourd banjo uh, made by a art teacher in in uh, Jamaica. <laughs> okay, here we go. Two, three, four. Oh, Guinea Sam, Lord, he's a two-handed conjuring man. Guinea Sam, Lord, he's a two-handed conjuring man. Well, they said his real name was not okay, and folks called him Thank you. 
shirt set of jeans and showed his pretty white teeth. Then he looked at you, you got to tremble all over, cause he's looking right into you. Again he said, Lord, he's a two-headed government. Again he said, Lord, he's a two-headed government. Well, sister got sick on the Tuesday And she couldn't move nothing but her eyes Guinea Sam come in, he started spreading salt and pepper And out jumped a whitey little three-legged creature Hopping round like it was a fly Johnny got sick on a Sunday And the doctors couldn't do him no good Guinea Sam come in, he said John, somebody tricked you Got a snake in your belly I got a little smell here Gonna take it right out of you Guinea Sam, Lord, he's a two-headed country Guinea Sam
wouldn't that be fun when we could all dance to that? Yeah, that's what that's a new one we've been working on. This is that we really missed you. Yeah. We really miss you. Yeah, it's not the same. Uh, not yeah. seeing the dancers out there. We love playing for you and uh, yeah. look forward to getting back as soon as possible. Okay, everybody give sad eyes to the camera. Okay, now give happy eyes to the camera. <laughs> okay, there we are. Okay. Hi, all. I know this is not usually an old time tune done for old time contra dances but uh it is an old tune yeah a classic and you'll probably recognize it flattened scrugs don't that road look rough rocky <laughs>
Just get ready. <laughs> this oh is boy. called the wall pole cottage. I have no idea why it's called the wall pole cottage. But I guess Dave knows. Maybe. And Dave possibly. Is there was a church named after the wall pole cottage. <laughs> Why the cottage was named, perhaps it was a fancy name. I don't know. Alright, this is the problem with online learning. Uh, uh, okay, but uh, let's do it any this year. Okay, we're going to let Dave take a solo on this one. What? Are we ready? Yeah! One, two, three, four!
did this with the ladies at play up in stellar dance camp many of you have been there with larry and aaron mccullen and there's a great joke that this all and we called jolie you know all these people anyway um and it's really fun to play and really fun to dance to so it's called alligators dentist and gator boots for jolie and we'll feature an actual extra uh, extra special part of percussion uh, section here. This um, few people know that um, that Erica's late husband and former band member Gary Libman started his adult life uh, studying to be a dentist, as at the behest of his mother, I guess, which <laughs> went unfulfilled. But in the either giveaway or throwaway pile at the house was apparently one of Gary's uh, tests, and uh, she's Erica was going to get rid of it, and I said. Oh no. No, no. We have to keep this. So we thought Gary could still be in the band here. In the Some other time we'll tell you the whole joke. Okay. Ready, guys? Wake up. Hey! Okay. Go.
Welcome to the next time.